Qatar has been looking for support from the international community to solve its crisis with the four Arab nations. Qatari Foreign Minister Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdulrahman Al Thani has been meeting his Chinese counterpart Wang Yi in Beijing. China has called on all parties to address their differences within the framework of the Gulf Cooperation Council. Our reporter Adel Mahroui has more on the ongoing Gulf Rift. The Qatari Foreign Minister Mohammed bin Abdurrahman Al Thani keeps his global tours trying to get support to Qatar in the diplomatic rift that has been led against it by four Arab countries. Um, he has met uh, with the Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi, through which Qatar has described the meeting as positive, particularly after China has called for all parties to resolve the crisis quickly and sit to talk on the negotiating table or have positive face-to-face -face dialogue. But on the other hand, um, the Qatari permanent uh, envoy in the United Nations said that Qatar will only sit in, in direct talks once the sanctions are lifted. They insist, Qatar has been insisting, that talks must be held only under uh, normal um, circumstances so that they will have equal um, uh, partnership or equal um, uh, talks so that no one would have the upper hand over the other during these talks. Meanwhile, Qatar announced on Thursday the interior minister uh, said that um, the IP addresses of the um, attacks of the computers or electronic devices used in the cyber attack that was held back in May indicates that these devices were based in the UAE, which indicates that um, the government of the UAE might have been involved. It has not been said explicitly, but at least they say they have solid proof that um, indicates these devices were inside um, the Emirates. Since um, the escalation in this um, new development of this uh, cyber attack and UAE's possible involvement, we've seen the Arab countries taking more of a softer approach than before. Um, and now there are six broad demands that they have been have announced in Cairo uh, weeks ago. And it seems that this is where um, the negotiations will be going around. Um, many global parties are pushing forward for these parties to sit and talk. But so far, none uh, of them, Qatar or Egypt, Saudi Arabia, Emirates and UAE uh, and Bahrain from the other um, side uh, seem to be willing to sit on the negotiating table yet. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo.